great day today, and I will tell you why. Um, yesterday, actually, and I couldn't do it yesterday because I didn't have time to film the video. Um, I got 40 subscribers, so I'm super pumped about that. Thank you to everyone who has stuck with me and supported the channel and liked my videos and left comments. I always look for comments more than like the likes and views and everything just because I love communicating with people in the community. But it is also a great day because I received this little number right here, a priority mail package sent direct from one Sir Rory over at Brotherhood of Cigar and Pipe Men. Uh, my friend, you are beyond generous. Um, I, you could have put a dead hamster in this thing, and I would have been overjoyed that you even bothered, really. So, um, it's unopened. I have not opened it at all um, today using the Smith & Wesson boot knife, spear point. Uh, just a little throw in the plug for the knife. And let's see what is in this baby. All right. Well, I certainly don't skimp on tape. Okay, well, now that the box is open, I can throw the box over there. Um, and here's what I have. Let's see, I'll start with the smaller piece. Wow. Put tape over tape over bubble wrap over tape over bubble wrap. Mm. This thing needs to be sharpened. I haven't sharpened it in a while and I use it like crazy. All right. So, looks like a Jetline torch lighter. Let's see this baby. Okay. Ah! Oh. Oh, I'm sorry. Three flame. Wow. That I, I've seen these before. They're supposed to be really good uh, cigar torches, but see, it's just um, press the button, and the lid opens up, press it, and there goes the flame. That's great. Oh, man. I love it. Looks like it's butane filled. Yeah. Butane filled. Oh, man. That is so cool. I'm going to sit that right there. He also wrote me a letter, um, and I read that, and I thank you very much, sir, for your kind words and for your extremely generous gift. The fact that it is not a dead hamster is just making my day even better. So, um, no, I'm, I'm really, I'm overjoyed that he took the time to, not only, he took a lot of time deciding what to get me. He had to write to Cigar Noob, and see what Cigar Noob rep recommended. And um, I, I mean, that must have taken, I, it's more commitment than I put into almost anything in my entire life. So, <laughs> and that tells you a little something about me. So, let's see what we got here. Oh man, those look great. More tape. Oh, and there's the cutter. Okay. Wow, that is so great. All right, it's two cigars and a cigar cutter. And unfortunately, I won't be able to smoke these in this video because as you can see, I'm in a completely different setting. I'm in someone else's house. This is um, my friend's house. I'm uh, watching her dogs. They are currently outside running in puddles. Um, yeah, so I'm, I'm dog sitting right now and I'm actually at their house and I ran home and got this and then came right back over here to uh, let the dogs out. Wow, that's so cool. Okay, looks like this one is, I don't know if it'll focus. Wolf Pack, yeah, Wolf Pack, handmade. And I don't think I've ever heard of that brand. But you know what? I'm gonna keep the band off of this in a special place. And uh, well, you know what? I might be able to smoke these. Um, they have this awesome outside porch and I, it, I mean, it's just a cool, it's like 70 degrees out right now. It just stopped raining. Um, so it might be a perfect time to smoke my first ever cigar. And I will definitely share that with you guys. And this one, um, it just says number 99 sweet single. Um, it doesn't say anything else uh, brand wise. So I'm not exactly sure what brand it is. 
but like I said, Rory, beyond grateful for the absolutely amazing, the lighter, the cutter. I mean, you sent the whole shebangarang, all right? And I am absolutely grateful, and I cannot thank you enough for being so gracious and welcoming me so fully into this community, which I love, and I am absolutely going to stay making videos and keeping in touch with everyone. And I also had a huge list of shout outs. Like I had maybe six channels, six or seven channels that I wanted to give shout outs to. And I forgot that list. Um, when I make, and I'll actually separate these into two separate videos, um, the box opening and me smoking my first cigar. Um, just, I don't know. I just feel like that's appropriate. But uh, I'll uh, try and look up some of those channels because I remember a few of them. I just don't remember the whole name and I'd have to get the links and everything for the, the uh, to put in the description. So I'll try and get those before I actually light the cigar. And um, thank you again, Rory, for everything. If you haven't gone to his channel, Brotherhood of Cigar and Pipe Men, he's an awesome guy and I could never thank him enough for not sending me a dead hamster. So thank you very much, Rory. Uh, and I'll be right back with another video of me smoking my first ever cigar via Brotherhood of Cigar and Pipe Men. Rory, you're the bomb. All right, guys, so I'm back here again. I'm out on the patio. Um, and basically, I have no experience with cigars at all. So I'm going to um, do what I'm going to do based on some things that I've watched, you know, how-to videos or what other people have done. So, as far as I understand it, leave in the comments if I'm wrong. Okay, this on this end is pre-cut, you know, there's the tobacco. On this end, it has that cap. So, I cut just below the shoulder so that there's still some of that adhesive to keep it together, but it's not going to fall apart and unravel itself. So, let's see how that goes. So, I just cut it um, right there. This is all I cut off was this tiny little piece, just... Just like that. Um, hopefully that's not too much. Um, we'll see. But um, I'll get into lighting it now. really like that actually wow that's really good Rory your tastes are um very good I, I really like that now from a pipe smokers perspective I haven't been a huge fan of the Virginias and uh, stuff that I've tried and I haven't gotten into Englishes So, this would be much more like a Virginia or an English, but it's really good. Just making sure I have it lit. I really like that. Well, um, consider me a pipe and cigar smoker now. That's, wow, that's really good. I'm just trying not to over light it, but make sure it stays lit. Yeah, I really like that, Rory. Um, good on you for your selection, because that, that's really good. It's super mild. Um, it's not like hitting me like a cigarette or anything like that. Uh, you know, like it's not burning my mouth. It's got a good flavor. Um, trying to describe it. It's definitely got some sweetness in there. And blowing it out my nose, it I can smell a lot of like tobacco, or um, not tobacco, uh, it almost reminds me exactly of pipe tobacco, but a lot more 
how, how do I put it, earthy. But then again, I'm used to the stuff that's put through, you know, the processing of flavoring and casing and all that kind of stuff. So, I imagine this is what an English would be like. Wow, that is really good. Um, yeah, so whenever I can from now on, I'm going to try and get some good cigars. Maybe like um, if anyone else has any other brands, because I'm really not sure what this one is. It just says, uh, well, if it would focus on it, I guess not. Uh, yeah, it just says 99 Sweet Single. I don't know what's wrong with my focus today. I've been using my iPhone for a lot of my videos recently just because it's got a way better camera. And I like the quality a lot more. My last video, or one of my last videos, I filmed on my iPhone, but then it ran out of memory for videos. So I had to transfer it over to my iPad and then um, download it from there. And it didn't turn out well at all. Um, so, I mean, but I, I'm, I've got a lot of memory left on it for, or for this video. And what I'm going to start doing is as soon as it's got some hits, like some views and stuff, I'm going to delete it from my phone just so it stays on YouTube because I've had that problem in the past where if it doesn't have the views, it just goes away. But, um, yeah, so I'm going to make sure, do everything in my power to keep the videos at the best quality, which will be filming it on my phone, honestly. And I'm sorry if it's not focusing on my face. There's the sun in the background, so the brightness is kind of messed up. But, um, yeah, I'm going to do my best to make sure that every video is at good quality. And that's just, like, me. That's my personal bug is that I, I don't like the, or I like to have as high quality videos for as low cost as possible. Wow, that is really good. I like that. So... This is my first attempt at smoking a cigar, and hopefully I'm not blundering the whole thing too badly. But yeah, that's really good. So, good on you, Rory, for uh, your selection. Um, I can't wait to try the second one, and uh, I, I really look forward to trying it. And I basically get this house to myself for the entire week, so... I'll probably come back out here another day this week and smoke another or smoke the other one, because um, this is really good. Now, now I'll admit my um, conception of or my preconception of a uh, cigar smoking was based off of every rundown person in the world who smokes the grape Swisher sweets, which I'm sure they're good and all. I've tried some Swisher Sweets, some of the cheap cigarillos, but this is much classier. Definitely a lot classier. And um, as soon as the band, which is about to come off anyways, as soon as it's ready to come off, I will uh, keep the band as the first cigar band that I've ever collected from the first cigar I ever smoked. Wow, that is really good. I'm really enjoying this. So yeah, like I said, y'all can consider me a cigar and pipe smoker now. I think I'm going to stick to pipes mostly, but only for, you know, you can spend 15, 20 bucks on a single cigar. You can spend that much on pipe tobacco and it'll last you. Well, at least someone like me who only smokes, you know, maybe two, three days a week, if that, and it's only when I feel like it. Um, like a pouch of, let's just do Captain Black Dark. That'll last me for at least a month. I mean, at least a month, probably more than that. But um, yeah, so it's, it's definitely a bit cheaper. Pipes are more expensive, but then again, pipes will last you for a long time. I really like that. Just got a piece of it in my mouth. Yeah, so th I think that's why I'm going to stick to pipe smoking primarily. But definitely whenever I can get one, whenever I can afford it, um, I'm getting cigars. And there's the band. 
got the band. I don't want to unravel it necessarily. I might flatten it, but um, yeah, if I can flatten it, I will definitely keep that somewhere, scrapbook it or whatever, and uh, that'll just be part of the memory. That's really good. And this thing will last me. I don't know how long. Hmm. Yeah, that's really good. So, Rory, I thank you so much for your generosity. Uh, can't wait to hear back from you in the comments and everything and around in the community on the videos and everything. Man, you're, you're great. You're awesome. Keep up the good work. Keep doing what you do. And I'll see you all later.